Hello, this should be an enticing prospect. Welcome to the Estadio de Vallecas. I'm Derek Ray. My co-commentator is the former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon, and we should have a pulsating game of football for you. It's Rayo Vallecano taking on Ibar. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man. Lee, what do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, his ball possession will be his key. People give him the ball because they know he links the play. You give him the ball, then you make a run, you normally get the ball back, which is very encouraging. Here's how it looks for Rayo Vallecano. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. And so the Eibar starting 11. In goal, it's Marco Dimitrovic. Arbia plays with Cote in the fullback positions. Pedro Leon plays with Takashi Inui on the flanks. And the striker on this occasion is Kike Garcia. And so the battle commences. Catena. Oscar Trejo. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. So close to keeping himself onside, but offside is the verdict. Well, and that's his job, the linesman. Give those tight offside decisions and get them right. Into the advanced position. Edu Exposito. Fabian Oriana looks promising this. And a throw in it's going to be. Will he play it in? But he has just veered into an offside position this time. And the ball with Edu Exposito. Burgos. Pedro Leon. Well, you know, most teams have a preferred way of playing. The visitors do like to press high. They try to force errors. Lee, do you anticipate seeing that from them in this game? Yeah, I do, Derek. I really do. It's a brave way of playing, though, away from home. It just shows the confidence the coach has in this group of players. Here's Alvaro Garcia. Suarez with it. I must say, no shortage of space. Oscar Trejo. They do pass the ball with authority. Here's Alvaro Garcia. Regained possession. Arbia, Pedro Leon, Fabian Oriana, still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. They could pick out a teammate. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Jose Angel, it's with Bigas, Diop. Garcia, run it magnificently and intercepted.
Esteban Savelic. He's using his strength to good effect. Well, great read there to intercept. That's a lovely ball. Arbia. Pedro Leon. Now he must favour the cross. Excellent ball towards the front first. Absolute. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, here's the replay. I never liked rebound goals off goalkeepers. The defenders should be there. Probably would have been my fault. On that occasion, his defenders went missing. So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Suarez with it. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. Here's Advincula. He's got space. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Suarez. This could be an interesting avenue. Job. In possession, Takashi Inui. Jose Angel. Orellana. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Arbia. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's... The two teams have switched around. And are ready now for the second half. Luna. What a shocking pass, really. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Job. Fabian Oriana. Pedro Leon, an attack full of promise. And it's played into the centre. Almost. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. He's now got to be extra careful. A verbal warning rather than a caution here. Yeah, the next one, he knows where he's going in the book. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Every player's dream, only the goalkeeper to beat from the spot, but he's put it wide. Well, it's a close miss, but it's still a miss. Luna, Catena, a chance maybe from the wide position, he's in with a chance, surely, and a goal, the equaliser, superb entertainment. Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when he comes to him, he chooses early to volley it. 
What a finish. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, a penny for his thoughts right now, Derek. Plan B, I think, is needed. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Well, Ibar certainly enjoying the bulk of possession here, but the rest needs work. It's too slow moving the ball. There's no imagination. Need a lot more from them. Arbia. Charles. Moving the ball effectively. And they deal with the threat this time. It is a decent looking attack here. This looks promising. Electing to cross into the centre. And a goal kick given. Catena. Suarez with it. So a throw in here. Burgos. Arbia. Escalante. Orellana. Escalante with it. Good looking sequence. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Jose Angel. Escalante. Edu Exposito. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Inui. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Luis Advincula. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. Inui. Jose Angel. Spot on with that tackle. Over the touchline for a throw in. Just 10 minutes to go. In possession, Takashi Inui. And the ball with Edu Exposito. Fabian Oriana. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Can they get themselves in front here? And touched onto the frame of the goal. And a throw in it's going to be. Pedron. And the ball with Edu Exposito. Jose Angel. Edu Exposito. Orellana. Luna. And a chance for him on the flank. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. And the cross not quite accurate enough. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.